All right, welcome back everyone to Plant-Based Kidney Health. As always, I'm Dr. Sean Hashmi and my partner is Michelle Krosmer. Michelle, today's question is, is for people who are following a kidney-based, plant-based diet, do they need to supplement with vitamin B12? This is a great question. So the general population, people who are following a vegan, vegetarian, or plant-based diet are typically recommended to supplement vitamin B12 because they are not getting it um, at all or in adequate amounts from the diet. Now, people um, who have kidney disease in general, so not in the plant-based field, um, routine supplementation with B12, it's not recommended across the board. Some people might need it, some people might not. Um, but now we're combining those two things. So if someone has kidney disease and they're following a you know, plant-based, vegan, vegetarian diet, then they are not consuming that from their diet. So they would need to supplement with vitamin B12. Uh, so I guess in short, the answer is yes, but there's always extra things to consider with kidney disease. Um, one is that, again, with supplements in general, that they're oftentimes you know, not regulated. We've talked about this before, that we want them to be third-party tested because oftentimes um, they can contain way less or way more than what they actually say on the bottle. And our kidneys are you know, helping to filter toxins and waste products and you know, vitamins and minerals. And we want to make sure that we are not overloading them. And the other thing I would say too with B12 is a lot of times it's coming in very, very high doses. Now this is because it's, you know, it's poorly absorbed. And especially as we age, we're not absorbing as much. But you know, what I would say is, you know, a lot of times there are a thousand micrograms or three thousand micrograms of vitamin B12. And so split that up. If you can get like a, you know, it's better be taken sublingual anyways for absorption. So if you get like the dropper form or liquid form of B12, and instead of taking a thousand micrograms out, you know, in one day, if you can spread that out over your week, then that's going to be a better option. It's not the super, super high dose that might not be fully absorbed, but also, again, we want to be extra careful with kidney disease. So um, again, if you are kidney disease or not, if you're following plant-based, vegetarian, vegan diet, supplementing with B12 is important. Um, making sure it's, you know, third-party tested that ideally a sublingual form of it, and then try to, get, you know, spread it out throughout the week instead of taking very high doses of it um, all at one time. And um, that's really it when it comes to the V12. If you guys have other questions on that, then drop them in the comments and we'll see you guys next time.